I want to make movies. This little sticky note is always on my wall to remind me that I want to make movies. So why haven't I uploaded a video in almost a month? A friend of mine in lit class today asked me, Hey Adam, when's your next video coming out? And I said, I don't know. That was such a reality check for me. I don't know when my next video is coming out. And I don't know what it's going to be about. But I'm telling you now, that's going to change, okay? I am such a perfectionist. I am my own biggest critic. I spend hours, days, weeks, months critiquing the littlest things, trying to get the perfect video. And I can tell you right now that that's never going to happen. But when I stop posting videos because I don't think that they're good enough, that's the day that things are going to change. My dad is in the kitchen making matzo ball soup because tomorrow's Passover and you know how it goes. So I, I want to, you know, I want to say like, Dad, can I have some, some matzo balls? And he's like, yeah, because, uh, well, you know, tomorrow's Passover. I didn't know if I could, I could have one, one or two now or if I had to wait for the Seder tomorrow. You know, and he's like, yeah, it's fine, you can have one. There's about 40 matzo balls. Here's, um, 40 matzo balls. So. So I, I, my first thought is like, wow, that's a lot of matzo balls. And my second thought is, wow, f about 40 matzo balls? That sounds like the name of a really good documentary. I thought one day I want to make a documentary, one day I want to make a video about Jewish foods. Call it about 40 matzo balls, because some about that phrase resonated with me. I don't know, man. I like matzo balls, all right? And I thought, I thought, why do I have to wait to make a video about 40 matzo balls? Why can't I just pick up my camera and make a video about 40 matzo balls? There's nothing stopping me. So, I would like to tell you right now that uh, the matzo balls are really good. And I currently have a pot downstairs of about 40 matzo balls. And I cannot wait for Passover tomorrow. And um, that's honestly all I have to say.